Hi, I'm Maddie from Madison's Medicine. Thank you for joining me today. Um, if you'd like more information on this or on any of my techniques that are going to help you empower your own unique self-care, just look out for my bite-sized blog or my home study modules or visit madisonking.com. Okay, what am I going to talk to you about? today. I'm going to talk to you about feet, okay? So if you're not into feet, you can turn me off right away, okay? But feet are amazing things. I'm a qualified reflexologist and I've always been fascinated by feet. Call me strange, but whatever. Um, but this is not about necessarily about reflexology. This is about um, a point on the foot, the kidney one point, the wellspring, the bubbling spring of energy, which is really important to keep open. Now, I wonder if you can see, you will um, locate it if you come down from this second toe down to about here. Can you can see where that little dip is there, where the color of the foot's changes here in line there. Just, you're not an acupuncturist, okay? You're not going to be putting a needle in there. Just gently massage this. Also, you can open it up, okay? Really open it up. You can pull the toes back and open this way. You get the idea. I am trying to open that area. That is kidney one, bubbling spring. Okay, it is said to be the first point on the entire meridian system. Meridians being those pathways of energy around the body. So by opening and stimulating that point, you are improving its ability to inhale the energy from the earth upon which we walk because there is a polarity with the earth and you take in energy through that point. Um, so I think it's Donna Eden that calls it suckability, okay, you're improving your suckability of energy up into the body. The other thing whilst we're on the um, sole of the foot and talking about polar polarity, if you've been on a long plane journey, a long train journey, a long car journey where you have been off the ground, your polarity, your relationship to the planet may have switched. A very simple way to get that back is this, this little baby, a stainless steel spoon. Okay, so you're just going to open up and with the soft part, of the rounded part of the spoon, you're just going to come up over the foot. Now, you can come up in a figure of eight, you can circle around, doesn't really matter, okay? But this is going to begin to get your polarity back to default fast track to what nature intended so that you can accept the energy coming up from the earth rather than repelling it, that your polarities are in harmony rather than repelling each other. Do this for however long feels good, 20 seconds, 30 seconds, whatever. Um, I tend to end, but it's a personal preference, coming up off the toes, off the toes. Okay, and then I would just take my hand, just massage that open like that. And then I take the heel of my hand and I just push it against the side of my foot. In reflexology terms, that is the entire length of the spine. You can also do it with your fingers if you want. Oh, it feels a little bit tender there. Oops. Okay, so you're working your entire spine, a little added bonus. Okay, so that's enough for today. Not too much of a good thing in one go. Kidney one, open it up, open up your wellspring of life, your bubbling spring. Get your polarities working so you're attracting the energy. And work by reflex your entire spine. Okay, well for Merlin and me, in as you can see, in Spain, sunny Spain, bye-bye and thank you for being with us today. Bye-bye.